Alright, everybody, now I am Patrick Woodcroft. I am Kat Laura. I'm Katia. I'm Jack. I'm Nina. I'm Patrick. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Right, so Hi, I'm Patrick Woodcroft, 37 years old, born in Brisbane, Australia. My name is Mina. I'm born in Sweden. Hi, I'm Laura Rose Woodcroft. Hello, my name is Katia. I'm 10 years old. Hi, my name is Jack. I'm 8 years old. I was born in the Gold Coast. I was born in Sweden and I live in Brisbane. I run Synergy Campaigns, it's a boutique film production company. I work with a company and do their finance. I go to school, I'm in grade 4. I am 10 years old, I live in Brisbane and I was born in Sweden. What I do is I go to school. Film production company for visionaries, pioneers and game changers who are having a massive positive impact. I can work from wherever I want in the world because it's all online, so that's great because I love to travel. I love playing in the bush with my family. I go to school and I am in grade four. I'm in year three and I love my family. For me, life's all about people and places. I love my family. I love going to interesting new places and meeting inspiring new people. I've been traveling for the last 11 years. I love my family. I love animals. I really like singing. I love my family because they look after me and take care of me and make me feel so loved. Um, my favourite thing is to go on my road late. I like going shopping and playing tag with daddy. I love animals because they're so cute and fluffy and just... <coughs> fluffy. Sorry. Fluffy. 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 Other things I love to do is go shopping and I also love trying new food and um, eating in fancy restaurants and going on dates with my husband and yeah, that's the things I love. I love singing and dancing because it's fun. So yeah, my best holiday was when we were in Bali because um, I could get up early at sunrise, get all the dogs from the neighbourhood, run down to the beach, jump in the ocean, do exercises on the beach at sunrise and um, Come home and have a big coconut or a big banana smoothie, that was awesome. How about you, Nina? What was your best, best holiday? My best holiday was when we went to Singapore. Oh, yeah. And we stayed at Shangri La mm. in a big family room, best view. And we went to Santosa and went on zip line. <laughs> oh, <laughs> in Megazip. Oh, yeah. I love oh, so that. what else did you love about that? Uh, we got to eat lots of yummy food. And Man, you're like the buffet breakfast. That's oh, what you're all about. Buffet breakfast. <laughs> amazing. We had to try all these new different foods from different countries. It was amazing. My best vacation was when I, when me and Kitty went on an early birthday present from our grandparents. It was a seven-day cruise ship. Oh, wow. Where'd you go? The, um, we went to Tokyo. No. We went to Thailand. Where's your cruise from? Um, Singapore. Oh. Jack? I skiing. Best vacation you've ever had? I skiing. Tell me about that. What was good about that? Well, I got to learn how to ice skate. I fell over many times and I, I, I got to bleed a little bit. But well done. The part that hurt me the most was my bum bum. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite vacation was when our grandparents took Laura and I um, to Thailand on the Royal Caribbean. It was really fun. Nice. We're the same best one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we got jelly. Jelly for pudding. <laughs> so what do you guys have in common? We all have blonde hair. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, blonde hair. There you go. We all got beautiful blonde ponytails. We've all got beautiful blonde ponytails. And a unicorn. Oh, and a unicorn. And a unicorn. Oh, Girls have blue, beautiful blue eyes. Jack's got deep, dark, hazel brown eyes. Tell me some more differences. Okay. Jack. Um, Jack's a boy, we're girls. girls. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. That's yeah. Good. yeah. Just in case you didn't notice. <laughs> Kitty likes to organize things. She likes to organize. I like, Jack likes to. Because, of course, do jumps on you. really likes to <laughs> Is that what you're having fun? No, and I, yeah. <laughs> and I, we're going back 
And well, we can going about into the different things yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, we can talk about the difference too because that was one of the questions. And yeah. I like padding guinea pigs. Oh. Yeah, we all like padding guinea pigs. We love padding guinea pigs. That's another thing in common. We love animals, oh, right? Yeah, we love animals. <laughs> yeah, they like can only be gods of baby chickens and the baby piglets. <laughs> oh, they're so pretty. What's your favourite food and do you like to try new foods? Huh. Pizza. Pizza. Um, pizza. Um, so we all love pizza. Um, burger. What I'm most proud about my kids is that they are so good at having a conversation with any person, any age, and just keep it going and being engaged. And yeah, that's what I'm most proud of them about. So, hmm, tell me this what do you guys do for fun, fun, fun? Well, we play together. Um, what do you play? I don't usually play with Mom and Patty, so I have something different. Huh, what do you do? Let's hear it. I, if we have time, we I play on the iPad. Yeah. Or I just play with my cars. Yes. Yeah. Or if it's on holiday, I go out on my rollerblades. Rollerblades? Yeah. Or I play with the guinea pig. <laughs> the guinea pig. Or I take the guinea pig out to a park. Or I do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Kitty, what do you do for fun, fun, fun? What I like to do is gather Laura, Jack, and Laura, Jack, Dad, and I, and go out into the forest and play hide and seek tag in the forest. Oh yeah, that's the best. Ooh, yeah, love that. Really How about you, Laura? I love that too. <laughs> I like singing. Uh huh. Would you sing for me? No. Later. Yeah. All right. Yeah. What else do you love? I like to go on my rollerblades yeah. and um. Play with my friends. Yeah. If we have play. Yeah. Go shopping with my mummy and Kitty. Oh, the girls. Nice. What do you do? We buy stuff. <laughs> what do you love about that? I love walking around the shopping centre with my mummy. Mwah. Oh, yeah. What do you do after? Go to a restaurant, have some lunch? Yeah. Not ice cream. And sometimes. Ah! <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for your big hubble. Give mommy a big hubble and get out of here. Let me come to you, my love. Yes. What does your typical weekend look like? Did you say what does that typical weekend look like? We don't have a typical weekend. We're not typical people. <laughs> Today, we're going down to the Northern Street Organic Markets, hang out with some friends down there and have some, we probably have some fancy chai. Um, this afternoon, we'll go to South Bank, take the kids out for a swim. Uh, yesterday, I was working on contracts for my business, that wasn't so exciting. Uh, but in the afternoon, we had a party. Had our friend come around who's an author, she's just written a brand new book, and she brought her book round to the first draft copy to open it up, so that was super exciting. Um, well, if we go visit friends, we go out for dinner, we'll go out for lunch. Uh, ice skating. Go ice skating. Go for walks. Go out to the forest. Uh, dinners, if the kids have been yeah. to school, go for rewards. Go to the movies. Yeah, there are lots of different things. We don't have a typical weekend. <laughs> right. What else we got on this list? Who makes you most proud of your children, Patrick? You know what, if I'm really honest, I feel so blessed to be father to those children. They're just so amazing. I love it when I hear from people who've met them how, how well behaved they are, how well mannered they are, how you know, the conversations that they have is just extraordinary. Um, how well developed they are and how well adjusted they are. Even when we just, you know, we just got back to Australia six months ago after three and a half years of, of travel. And um, everywhere we go, they just connect with, with kids and old people and adults and everybody in between. And even now that we're back here and they're back into school and, you know, they've had some big adjustments. The teachers, even the principal of the school who I met with a couple of days ago, she's so impressed. She said, these kids are such a valuable part of this learning community now. We're so excited to have them here. Um, yeah, those kind of things really make me so proud. When I see them taking care of each other, when I see them being responsible um, and looking out for other people, being proactive and kind and, and creative, I, it takes my breath away. Okay, Laura, and what do you like to do on the weekend? I like to sleep. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so I grabbed my children and they drive me crazy. <laughs>